the ins and outs of the car battery. The car battery is the main power source for your car so that you can operate it. In the winter months, the cold temperatures can wreak havoc on your battery if you don't maintain it properly. The battery loses precious power when the temperature drops below the freezing mark, so you should have your mechanic do a thorough inspection to make sure that it'll perform for you as it should. What makes up a car battery? A car battery is a rechargeable battery that supplies power to the parts of the car that allows you to start it up, such as the ignition system, starter, and lights. Most batteries are lead acid, which are comprised of alternating plates of lead and lead dioxide that is submerged in a sulfuric acid water solution. The power comes from the electricity that is produced by the electrons that are emitted from the chemical reaction between the plates and the solution. The chemical reaction changes the surface of the plates from lead to lead sulfate as the battery discharges and the process reverses itself when the battery is recharged. How to take care of a battery. Most batteries last up to 48 months, so if your battery is close to that age, you should consider replacing it. The cold weather puts extra stress on a battery and an older battery will not be able to tolerate it. Check to make sure that the battery is firmly seated and secured in the bracket. Make certain that you have the terminals cleaned by a professional if you notice any corrosion on them. You can clean off the case with a baking soda and water solution and a brush to keep the battery from permanently discharging. Replacing the battery. Do not trust an older battery to get through the winter. If you have an old battery, you should have it changed before the temperature drops. If the cold weather catches you by surprise and you encounter that awful silence of a dead battery, you can purchase a battery charger that plugs into an outlet inside your home or to a utility outlet on the outside of your home. Be sure to read the instructions so that you'll connect the clamps to the correct terminals and not overcharge. You can also jumpstart your car by connecting the dead battery to the battery in another car with jumper cables. Again, you must be sure that you connect the clamps to the correct terminals on both ends of the cables, or you can damage both batteries. If the battery is frozen, or if the sides appear to be bowed outward as if the battery is swollen, you should discard the battery. Your mechanic can show you how to jumpstart and charge your battery.